Today we're going to be demonstrating the sculpted mask with pomegranate peel. This mask is suitable for all skin types, in particular if your client is looking to brighten their skin and also rehydrate. It works really quickly to achieve that. The first step in the cleansing routine is to use Purity Solution, an oil cleanser that will deeply remove all the toxins and dirt. The second cleanse is using Benefit Clean, a gentle cleanser that contains a small amount of lactic acid. For the third and final cleanse, we'll use Purity Clean. This is our most exfoliating cleanser made with 5% lactic acid. Before I start doing the sculpted treatment, I'm going to use the Woods Lamp to conduct a seven point skin analysis. This will allow me to personalize the treatment for the client. The Woods Lamp has a magnifying glass that allows me to see the pores and pigmentation much more closely. The first mask we use is Pure Enzymes. This is made with cranberries and lactic acid and it's fantastic for refreshing the skin. After you've completed the cleanse, you need to wear some new latex-free gloves and then we're going to use Purity Balance, which is a prep solution made with witch hazel and lactic acid and salicylic acid that helps to open the skin up so that we can use active ingredients to penetrate the deeper layers. The solution we're going to use today is the pomegranate and this is made with 15% alactic. It's also got some natural moisture factors that are brilliant for rehydrating dehydrated skin. And there are some brightening ingredients as well. You only need to use a quarter of a teaspoon so make sure to measure out the exact amount of peel. After applying pomegranate peel, you allow it to dry for up to five minutes, then you use Sculpted Mask. This contains a mixture of ingredients that help to firm and brighten the skin, including rubber, turmeric, hyaluronic acid, and a brightening enzyme from pineapple called bromelain. This mask can be applied onto the skin all over the face, including the eyes and lips, and you can also use it with gauze underneath so that when removing the mask as one piece, it's a lot easier to do. After applying the mask all over the face, including the neck, you can leave it to dry for 10 minutes. While it's drying, the turmeric that's in the mask will oxidize and turn a dark yellow color. You'll know then that it's ready to remove. To finish off the treatment, you can use Relief, which is a peptide gel that's very cooling and also helps to remove any redness. OptiCrystals is our number one selling eye product. It's made with alpha lipoic acid and peptides that help to reduce the appearance of lines and dark circles around the eyes. You only need a pin drop amount because it will actually expand on your finger, then press it around the eye bone and leave to dry. I'm also going to use Rescue Balm, which is a combination of Shia and Yoba. It has an ingredient called Beta Gutan, which is incredible for healing the skin. 